So I'm sitting in the car right now. It's 21 degrees Fahrenheit outside. And I'm waiting on Pocket to come out because, you know, I'm the good spouse warming up the car. And I have a list of questions of like getting to know you and relationship stuff. Hi, babe. I like your hat. Okay, first relationship question. Ready? What were your first impressions of me? Super sweet, super cute, very mm -hmm. tall, very dedicated to queer nonprofit spaces. Aww. Passionate. Aww. This one. Okay, that was the first question. We're gonna go to the coffee shop. We'll do some more. Oh lordy, oh lordy, here we go. It was a really fun morning. We went into Beware Coffee. Decided we would grab a couple beverages, hang out for a little bit. Everything was super tasty. Some amazing uh, latte art and all of that. Pocket got a oat milk latte and I got a soy mocha. Good. It's good. Safety. Focused. Yay. Okay, so we tried recording inside. It was a little bit loud. So we're going to try this outside in the car. Um, great spot, though. Beware Coffee. It was really good. Check out Instagram. We've got some stuff up there. Um, okay. Questions. Uh, oh, what was your first impression of my friend? It was a lot. <laughs> a lot of people all at once. A lot of people all at once, yeah. But, you know, over the past almost eight years, I love them, they're great. Yeah. Lots of fun, we travel well together. Yeah, so when we first got together, uh, Pocket moved up to Seattle to for us to live together, and so it was like a trial by fire to like meet all my friends pretty much at once at this like huge party, so Pocket did a great job. When we were in Seattle, I was purses you know, partner, and when we moved to Tacoma. <laughs> Everybody's like, oh, you're married to Pocket. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, who are you? <laughs> so here's the recap of what we said inside. So inside for the things that we couldn't record were my favorite movie is Existence. Yours was a combination between uh, The Princess Bride and or Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Prejudice. Uh, we also did uh, favorite books growing up, which were October Sky. October Sky for Pocket, and for me it was Sam's Terrible All Wrong Day or something like that. Or the Berenstain Bears, because I went for like kid stuff and Pocket went for like teenager stuff. Um, what's the best party you ever went to? Oh uh, the best party I ever went to. Like what style of party? A fundraising party? A birthday party? Fetish party. <laughs> so there's quite a few. Sounds like there's too many to too many to put out there. Uh, mine was probably White Party Palm Springs somewhere in the early 2000s when it was uh, RuPaul on stage and she was performing and she told her backup dancers if, if they didn't get on stage that she wouldn't pay them. If they showed up late, she stopped her set, she kicked them off, told them she wasn't going to be paying them and then continued uh, her, her set. Uh, and then Britney Spears performed. Early 2000s. White Party Palm Springs, one of my favorites. At the time I was living in Los Angeles, so I just drove over and stayed at like a two-star hotel at the time. He didn't stay in a hotel. He found a hooker. He's a home. That too. Uh, do you have any hidden talents? No. No. No hidden talents. Whatsoever. You're sure you could take out somebody's kneecap? That's not hidden. <laughs> Everybody already expects the ankles are the first thing to go. <laughs> I don't know. I can touch, uh, touch my tongue with my nose. Not really a hidden talent, but <laughs> not really there you go. Sure, why not? That's it. <laughs> so we're gonna go probably grab some breakfast somewhere. Thanks for hanging out with us. Um, as always, Pocket versus find us on Instagram, YouTube, all that stuff. We love you. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.